Hello everybody, my name is Jacob, and welcome to Donkey Kong Country Returns! I have played Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, but believe it or not, I've never played this one! And I've heard nothing but amazing things about this one, so what's better to slice up our typical super long RPGs and horror games and critically acclaimed masterpieces than a critically acclaimed masterpiece of another kind. You know, more, a little bit more simple platforming game. Um, <clears throat> so here's the deal. I am emulating this. Um, purely because, um, that was for me testing it out. Um, I'm emulating this purely because I own the game on Wii. Um, but I know that there's one, every time anybody brings this game up, there's one major drawback that they always bring up, and that's the rolling. The only way to roll is to shake the controller, which is why I'm playing it emulated. I don't have to worry about that. I've bound everything to a controller, so now I'm theoretically playing the best possible version of the game. So let's play the best possible version of the game, then. Why don't we? Let's just hop right into it. The other good thing is, since I have played Tropical Freeze, I do have a somewhat of a grasp on how th these games, the like new Donkey Kong Country games, work. So shouldn't have to worry about any like weird, um, weird like, well, what do I do now? Where do I go? Burr, burr, burr. Might still take me a bit to get used to. Ooh. Okay, those guys were just trapped in lava? Well, you know, I'm kind of on their side, I think. We trapped in lava for that long. Not going to be too happy. Um, just might have to shake the rust off of my platforming skills uh, before I really hit my stride, but shouldn't be too difficult. Elephant. Oh, okay. I'm starting to piece it together. Oh, I did not like the way he just turned and looked at me. Oh, and they're stealing. But now, I know the real reason why. It's because the game needs antagonists. Um, but why bananas though? Why bananas for the for the um for the sentient? music mask guys why do they need bananas why do they want bananas it's diddy Rack. <laughs> he's like uh uh that's not great yeah but you shouldn't be the one to worry about that diddy is the big guy himself <laughs> Oh, no. Um, is this not... <laughs> He's like, you see this guy? Gee! <laughs> I loved that. Oh, man. Oh. I loved that. I loved his little, like, looking at the dude just like, B. And now we're in it! It's Donkey Kong, everybody! It's Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong, it's Donkey Kong, it's Donkey Kong. There's something in here. Yeah, there is. Boom, baby. Can I? Oh, I can't. Would have been cool if it, like, swapped back to the original Donkey Kong Country little SNES menu. Um, and that's one I am tempted to play. Um, purely because I never have. I The only Donkey Kong Country game I've ever played was Tropical Freeze. I've never played any of the originals um, on any system. Um, I've just only ever played uh, that one. Like, I was going to say the modern one, but I haven't even played, like, all of the modern ones. Okay, I got to remember, my favorite move to pull... Yeah, yeah, yeah. My favorite move to pull in this is... Yeah, the roll off the edge and the jump is very good. I also, like I said, I, 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 since I played Tropical Freeze, I know how this game, um, functions in terms of its, like, secrets and such. 
so I already know what I'm getting myself into. The only downside is, and I can't remember if this was actually in Tropical Freeze, or if it's just how I've always assumed it works. I've always been under the impression that if you hold the jump button when you land, you do the double jump thing, as opposed to you have to time it, which is how it actually is. Also, can we talk about, it's been said to death, but the music in this game is nigh perfect. Like, can you think of a better, okay. I continued to press the roll button, but that's fine. Can you think of a better soundtrack in a game? I can't. Oh, is it gonna give me, oh, bananas, 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 apples and bananas. Apples and bananas. Come on. I know I know how these games work. I get a thing if I get them all. Oh, come on. I'm timing it. Correct. Oh, is it gonna... Oh, but I timed it! That was gonna give me a puzzle piece, I bet. I would be shocked if it wasn't. Boom. Why are you gone? Go ahead and give me you. What do you do? Okay, nothing apparently. I forgot to roll. I forgot to roll. I would just spent that that last little bit bumping up my own skills, and I forgot to do the most basic thing in the world to continue to prove those skills. I gotta do this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Forgot what I assigned one to for a second. My boy is here, and he lets me do that. He's on my back. Do we have any confirmation, or have we ever had any confirmation as to if they are related, or it's just like a little brother, or like a cousin situation? Or just like, this is just the dude who hangs around... Um, that I, like, help out. Also, all of my gamer instincts really make me want to just go rolling or, like, jetpacking off this way. But I'm not gonna. Gamer instincts are not that strong. But you know what it is? Going this way. Yeah, baby. I told you. I know what I'm doing. I know how these games work. I love to jump around as the big donkey jerk. He's not a jerk. He's a sweet guy. At least in these games, he's a sweet guy. I can't speak for... Well, Mario vs. Donkey Kong, I know they're like... At the very end, it becomes a like sweet like... Oh, that's fine, donkey. Here, you can have your toys. Sort of thing. What's the point of this? Oh, that, apparently. This looks like... No. That's something I do heavily remember from Tropical Freeze, is keeping an eye out like this for areas that are like, will take you to another place. Okay. Just need to get all the bananas as quickly as possible. Okay. I know I can. I can lean to the side for this. I'd rather not. Yeah, baby. Come on, just just give it to me. There we go. I know I can maneuver to the sides to collect them. I'd rather not, because that's fairly risky. But I know that it is an option if need ever be. Yeah. They all get to go flying away now. Bop. Bop. And I can already tell I'm seeing the platforms above. This is going to be a process. Oh. Boop. Boop. Okay. All right. Here we go. Do that. Uh-huh. Then one of those. Yeah. I'm a gamer. I'm a hardcore gamer. Except I bet you I'd be willing to bet so much money that those... Oh, no you don't. I see the little, yep. I see. 
Yeah, that, that platform where I was bouncing them meant to catch the bananas, that absolutely was the other puzzle piece. Damn. Woo -hoo -hoo. Damn, I'm missing the one. Maybe we'll go back and grab it at some point. But show me that world map. I love a good world map. And the first one has such has such a sick world map, or at least a cool one. Yeah, the King of Kling. Oh, we're gonna learn that. Oh, okay. One, two, three. I know one is getting the Kong letters, and is there a oh, time attack? I gotcha. I bet I could do a time attack. I've never actually tried a time attack in Tropical Freeze. I don't even actually know if they are in Tropical Freeze. But I bet, given how, that this is the tutorial level, it's it's a quick one. Oh yeah, 57 seconds? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, that's gonna be bad. Okay, that's fine though, that's fine. There's no health in this level, is there? Definitely not. It's just all about going. And I got hurt. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's do this again. Okay. Boom, boom. Nope, not again. Gotta save the health for when I need it. Wow, I've already gone 30 seconds? How is that possible? Wait, is that counting the first time with the death? That's not fair. Why would you ever consider that? That's counting the first time with the death, isn't it? If this respawns with 45 seconds... Yeah, it is. Why would you do that? Why wouldn't you... Especially if you started me from the beginning of the level. Now I'm determined. Now it's become like... Now it's become like... A battle of wills. Oh, that last one almost got me. Almost got me. It almost got me, but it didn't. That's the big thing. That's what you gotta keep in mind every single time. We're not gonna do a time attack anymore. I've decided, I've made the executive decision we're giving up on the time attack. Is that silly? Jacob, you just started. I don't care. It's my playthrough. I get to decide if we give up on the time attack or not. And guess what? I'm deciding that we give up on the time attack. Not not. King of Kling. Now I wonder, since this is motion control based, is there going to be something that's weird like, oh, it's one. Okay. That's not too bad. I'm glad that I did. I ended up planning out my button placement kind of haphazardly. Um, so I'm glad it paid off in terms of where I put everything on my controller. Because I'm playing this with a PS5 controller. Because as I previously stated, I own the game, but I am, I am emulating it. There's goodies down here. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't an idiot. Ow. Ow. That felt rude, because I definitely... You saw me attempt to, like... Oh, what? I'm confused as to what exactly happened there. Okay, hold on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, why did I think it was that button? I thought it was the bumper for some reason. It's definitely not. Okay. Oh, and then, let me guess. Yep. I know how these games work. I know how they're, they function. I bet it was some weird thing of like, oh, he turned at the last second, so he's like, beak hit you or something. Is that the only thing I could, only explanation I could think? The only thing I don't like about this and Tropical Freeze is if I stand still and push the dash button, it does that. So if I'm not like getting the enough momentum, um, when I need to, like, it takes way more momentum than you would think to get up to a run to do the, like, roll from just standing still. 
you would think it would take less uh, momentum than it does. But boy, howdy, does it take some momentum. Okay, wait for you to turn around. And I can just do a little short jump. Okay, really didn't think I actually would make that short jump for a second. Really thought that that was not going to be it for me. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. Did I assign anything else to that? No. Maybe I should have. Huh? Yeah, why? I know how to... You think I don't know how to roll? Why would you tell me how to roll right now? The only explanation would be if you thought at this point in the level I didn't know how to roll. Which is wild that you would make that assumption of me. Fine thing to make the assumption of in the first level. Honey, we've already beat the first level. We're in level two now, baby. Okay, there's something I'm missing. Yeah, yeah, I ain't it. I ain't a fool. You take me for some kind of a fool. For I am not one. Oh, I was almost a fool. Oh. Okay. Uh huh. So close. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah. yeah. God, I'm so. I'm so good at video games, guys. Did you know that? Sometimes I think you guys need reminding. Sometimes I think you guys think I'm bad at video games. And it's moments like this where I really just gotta tell you, that just ain't it. The games themselves are what's bad. I'm always good. It's the games that are bad. Yeah, I really gotta add an additional binding for that shake. Either the shake or the roll or the uh, grab needs an additional binding. Honestly, might be both. Might be both, but we're, we'll deal with that in between episodes. Whoop. I see you there. Yeah, I saw you. About to munch. About to munch a crunch a bunch on me. What, you think I'm stupid? I'm stupid or something? Why did I... I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I out loud made the, like, breathing thing. Or, like, blew as if I am myself actually blowing in, like, the mic on the DS. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know how to spot a suspicious-looking um, waterfall area thing. I am a gamer. I am a true video gamer. Hashtag just gamer things. Hashtag gamer skills. Hashtag le epic gamer mood. I want to apologize to everyone for saying that. I've never felt more ashamed for being a gamer than I was literally just now when I said le epic gamer mood. Please don't hurt me. Okay, good. It was one of those where I couldn't tell if ducking down was the correct thing to do, or if it was like, you're just gonna get hit by this regardless. So just don't get hit by him. I mean, guys, you just, you just pulled the same shtick. Did you really think it wasn't gonna work? Or was actually gonna work the second time? Don't pull, don't pull the same shtick. If you don't have, if you... Don't do it right back. Like, do it like put another puzzle piece in between. Don't do it two puzzle pieces back to back. Unless they didn't. And I missed where one of the puzzle pieces was. Oh, ho, ho. Potential wrench thrown into my gaming shenanigans. Shenanigananananananans. Shenanigananananans. Now, do I think there's anything back there? No. Do I think that there might be a reason for me to land here? Also, no. The game has tried to trick me already. They think that I'm not as smart as I apparently am. 
I already solved your little put the same uh, hidden puzzle piece. Uh oh. Oopsie. Well, I really don't want to lose Diddy. So we're going to have to play this one super safe. Which means we do a little bit of one of these. <laughs> Alright, what have you? Not really worth it, if I'm being honest, but hey. It was something. It certainly was something. Okay, okay. Wait for that one to go by. Yep. Boom. Okay, okay. Wait for that one to go. Okay, yep. Okay, yep. Did we get all the... We didn't? We missed two? Where were the two we missed? I thought I was looking in every nook and cranny. Well, it appears maybe the egg is on my face. I was giving the game shit for not hiding them well, and apparently it hid them perfectly fine. My apologies, video game. This is also going to be a much chiller playthrough compared to um, some of the previous ones that I've been doing. Um, to the point where... Ooh, Cranky Kong Shop. It's about to have you visited your friend, old grandpa. You be shoving those shiny banana coins and you can pick through my old things. Grants one extra balloon, grants three extra balloons, grants seven. The three minutes will have one of those. Perhaps you five puzzle pieces. Is he consistent in every level? Like, that's the thing. I don't know if... I know the temporary invincible... Obviously, that one doesn't stick. Um, but... Also, the sound effects on those are so good. Just listen. So good. I think he disappears after you use him for a level. So we're not going to use... Buy any of those right now. We are going to buy the map key. Um... And can't say I expect to see you again, but you might get lucky, I guess. And that's all she wrote. Also, I mean, kind of obvious you guys would notice based on, you know, the length of the video. But this is going to be a shorter series um, in terms of the episodes, not in terms of the length of, you know, the series itself, because we're still going to be the same length because we're beating the video game. But I'm not... This is not... See, because I know a while back when I spoke about my philosophy on, like, doing the 45-minute long episodes versus not, and, like, what would qualify for a 45-minute episode versus what would uh, qualify for, like, a 30-minute one. I know that when I first talked about it, I said that it would be dependent on the length of the game based on like how long to beat and stuff and while damn it um and while i do take that into consideration um more and more recently like this is a game that i'm gonna be frank even though based on my own merits this game technically falls in the category of like needing uh, 45 minute episodes. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do a, an hour long episode of Donkey Kong Country Returns. Mostly because it's gonna be the same stuff. It's not like an hour long episode of an RPG where like there's gonna be important story bits or like the reason I would do an hour long episode for something like an RPG is there's a potential of whatever the like boss battle or something is, there's the potential that we might not make significant story progress in that uh, episode. Um, hence the reason why I would do like a 45 minute episode for something like that. But that's not really going to be the case here because hey, guess what? There's like, what, five worlds in this game? Um, I don't know how many levels are in each, but even if there's just five worlds, by the time this first episode is over, we will have gotten through three levels of the first world. I'm not saying this is gonna be a super short playthrough, but this is not a playthrough that 
me doing 30 minute episodes is going to mean, oh, this, this series is, um, the other reason I do it, to clarify, otherwise what I'm about to say won't make sense, um, okay, and now go, boom, um, the other reason that I tend to do it is because if I don't, for a super long, like, RPG type game, it means the series itself is gonna end up being like 40 minutes or, or 40 minutes. Hello? Is this not a... Okay, I thought that was a Rhino one. Um, the other reason I do it is because if I did 30 minute episodes for like Final Fantasy um, 15 or, or 15, Final Fantasy 7 or something, that means that that series would be like 80 episodes. Um, I'm not going to do that. There's no reason for me to do that. Um, versus, hey, guess what? If I do 30 minute episodes for Donkey Kong Country, oh no, the series that would have been 8 episodes will now be 13. Like, I'm not concerned about it for that reason. Um, as like I would be with a massive RPG. Okay. Okay, watch yourself. I see the, the, I see the way this works. Okay. Because I want him to survive. Yes. Because, yes, yeah, baby, yeah, baby. God, I'm so good at video games. I'm so good at video games. Did you know that? <sighs> it hurts. It hurts, I think. It hurts because, obviously, because of the hubris. Um, but it hurts because it was literally right after the hubris. It wasn't even, like... The game itself didn't even wait, like, a minute or two. It was just like, no, guess what? Guess what you're getting right now? And it said, pure, southern fried, good home cooking hubris. At least we have this. Wow, am I bad at the video game? Because guess what? Um... The first level, we were missing one puzzle piece. The second level, we were missing two. Now we're missing three. So am I bad at video games, actually? That's what it might... That's what it's seeming a little bit like. Dude, look at this. We're about to do... What's this level? Sunset Shore? Well, that's one four, so obviously we have to do that. Duh. Look at this. One episode. One episode. And we've got four levels done. We're almost to the boss of this world. Of the first world. It's not going to take us very long to do this. This is a fun little, like, in between the other bigger, more difficult game sort of uh, playthroughs, which is funny because um, we're still doing those other playthroughs. Um, I don't want to say what the other playthroughs are that are airing alongside this because I don't know if this is going up like first of the new batch or like third of the new batch um because if this is going up third of the new oh rude if this is going up third of the new batch then it would be fine but I just don't know because you would have seen what the other two games were playing this uh this chunk are and I don't want to spoil them if they aren't already up mother of pearl God, the music, the colors, the sunset, the daffodils. Okay. You froggies need to get the heck out of here. What the heck is going on? What the heck? What the heck is going on? God. Danganronpa, the Game Grumps playthrough specifically, truly does have a stranglehold on my entire life. Okay, yeah, baby. I was gonna say, there's no... Oh, and the little ant's moving by. That's cute. I was gonna say, there's no way that's there for nothing. For no reason. But the placement of that bush dude 
right after a moment where the game itself made me stop to smell or blow the flowers, that was evil. That was some nasty, nasty stuff. And you know that, video game, you know it was. So shame on you. Yep, I knew it. Knew there was something down here. I saw it, like, in the distance. Okay. I saw it, oh, like, a ways, or not in the distance, but, like, as I was coming up. I saw the, the little, like, oh, I can see underneath this area. I wonder what that, that's gotta have something to, something to do with a future little puzzle, and it did. By gosh, it really did. Didn't even think that would be there, but guess what? We found it, so. God, you know what the vo Oh, the voices of those guys remind me of a game I played as a kid, and I was tempted to name the game, but I'm actually not going to because saying that out loud just made me realize that I might do a playthrough of it, and if I do, I want to keep it a surprise because it's going to be one of those that I feel like a lot of people are going to be like, what the hell? I didn't remember. I didn't even remember the this game existed until you did this little playthrough of it. And I'll be like, yeah, that's why I'm here to remind you of your favorite little childhood games that I also loved um, because I went to the computer and played on the or I went to the library and played on the computer a lot. Almost said went to the computer and played on the library. A genuine um, Fraudian slip. And I would rather that not... God damn, I was so over top of them, and you know it. You know it, game. You know that was bullshit. Alright. Mm-hmm. Is this... I can't tell if this was the wrong way to go or the right way to go. Like, if this has a little secret, because if I recall... Okay, no, I got two... Um... I have two puzzle pieces left. What is... Okay. There's one of them, at least. No. Oh, 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 Kong. Kong, I think we broke some stuff. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think we broke quite a bit of stuff in here. Seems like maybe an ancient thing that, like, people would have liked to study, but... What do you care? You're a monkey. What do you care about humans studying. You're a monkey. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Ooh, hoo. Oh, strawberry, my favorite kind of fruit. Alrighty, everybody, we are off to the races with a brand new series, and I love it. Love it. There's something to be said for just a chill, just low stakes. I mean, I know the island's taken over, but they stole fruit, whatever. It's just a chill, low-stakes little playthrough. Not a game where we gotta save the world, just a game where we're rolling around collecting some bananas and beating the hell out of some little freaky instrument masks and hypnotized animal types. As a big old ape. Makes me maybe want to play the P uh, Peter Jackson's King Kong, the official video game based on the movie, which I think is the official title of that game. If I ever played that, would love to have that full title in the video title, even though I know it would never let me. Anywho, on that note, thank you everybody for watching. Like the video if you like the video, share the video if you'd like to share the video, subscribe if you'd like to as well. That would really help me out. I have been Jacob, and you have been wonderful. Thank you guys. Thank you, thank you. Always, every day, for sticking around and, you know, spending time with me. I know there's sometimes where I play games that really hit it big. Bayonetta 3 did really well, Mario RPG did really well, Resident Evil 5 did really well, and I know there's always going to be some games that don't do as well, but I gotta, I gotta mix it up with stuff that I love, um, or stuff that I want to play, in between all the stuff that's clearly going to get some clicks. And trust me, if those other two series are not up, at least one of them is going to be one that gets some clicks, if anything, if I know anything. And this has been... Donkey Kong Country returns. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See you, Space Cowboys.